right, check it out. Rodolfo's here helping me out. Oh, yeah. He's actually came by to tinker around on his 240. But it's cool that he's over here helping. Anyways, I'm missing out on Super D because I have to take my intake off. We're missing out on Super We're. Yeah, that's right. You didn't go. Yeah, you're not going today either because you got actual family it's stuff cool. going on. Which is super, super bummy because this is like one of the only events. Well, not only events. This is definitely an event I didn't want to miss because it does not come on the northwest side very often. So, that sucks. But it is what it is. Um, I got to get this done. Like, this has to start running because I got um, video shoots and stuff coming up and I need to make it to them. We're, I'm going to finish doing this up today. Rodolfo's going to hang out for a little bit until he has to leave. And then, yeah. I'm gonna go set the camera down, start getting this intake off. Right meow. Rodolfo's doing it for the gram. You dig? You, yeah, dude, I dig. It's out. That was really, really simple. People were making this a way bigger headache than what it actually was, dude. That was like super simple. Yeah, they stressed it a bit. Just gonna pull a few bolts. Yeah, well, it's a good thing I didn't connect everything yet. Not having everything connected helped. Hey, Rodolfo. What up? What's your thoughts on the car? She's tits. Yeah? She'll be tits in a few weeks, too. Yeah, she will. Did you show them that interior? Yeah, dude, that interior is fucking oh, mint, dude. isn't it? I got the cracked dash, that's it. Other than that, everything else is flossy. Yeah. yeah. So, we got the intake right here. I'll show you guys. Out. The new one is inside. Um, I'll head over there in just a second to... Uh, Start tearing that. I gotta clean up the gasket on it, and then I gotta go to the. Nah, I leave it inside. I'm gonna work on it inside. Just right, right there. Uh, closer, closer. Ah, uh, uh, fuck it. It's cool. Yeah, you. <laughs> nah, just like right here on the. Yeah, there you go. I just want to work on it inside. It's gonna Where's be next to music. Guy? In the back over there. I know. I gotta do all this vacuum hose delete again and shit. So. Uh, yeah, it's, it does that. This one's a little cleaner. Gotta do another EGR delete. Stupid. You did it on that one? Yeah. Alright, so I'm gonna take this in there. I'm gonna start tearing apart the other intake. Oh boy, okay. So, everything is done. Well, everything's pulled apart. EGR is deleted. All the vacuum lines that I don't need is deleted. All the, um, basically all the emission shits is deleted. Good thing this car has good tags because I wouldn't have been able to delete it. But, it's good for two years. I don't plan on daily in this for two years. Soon, I don't know, I'm working really hard. I'm trying to get a daily, I'm trying to get things going. So, hopefully not for much longer. But, right now, I need to go to the bank. And then I need to go to the parts store to grab gaskets for this. And actually get real gaskets this time and not RTV. Um, and then I have to figure out my ma uh, mass airflow situation. So. I'll be right back. Alright, so crazy thing. While I have the uh, intake and everything out, I figured I'd be like, oh, there are some parts in the car. I wonder why there's a brand new thermostat. Gee, I wonder why they would put a brand new thermostat. Oh, look at that housing. Oh, no. Ooh, that's not good. Oh! Oh, no, no! Oh, buddy. Oh, my God. That is, uh... That is not good. That is not a good thermostat. So we're going to pull that out. I don't know how to pull this out. Maybe you just hit it with a hammer. Who knows? It doesn't just come out. I'm going to try hitting it with a hammer. Oh yeah, if you just hit it with a hammer, it should come out. Because <laughs> that's what I just did. That is fucking nasty looking. Yo, yeet. Alright, we're going to put this one in now. And then, because I got to wait. I got the gaskets for the intakes. The only thing I'm waiting on is a Mav. There's somebody in Salem I'm trying to see if my buddy can go pick it up for me or have it delivered here. I don't know. But we're going to kind of do a bunch of little stuff right now while stuff is out of the car and makes it easier. This is my theme song right now. Like, this is my life right now. I love this song. All right, I got the intake over here. I got the housing, the water, the thermostat, everything. New ish. It's not rusty, at least. Um, we're gonna start. I'm gonna start hooking all this back up. So let's get it, and then let's figure out my mass airflow. And that's that's it. I'm gonna double check the car afterwards and make sure everything that needs to be plugged in is plugged in. And uh, man, I hope she's ready.
All right, intake is on. Um, I know why that bolt wasn't fitting too. Uh, we're never gonna talk about this again, and we're gonna pretend like it never happened, but my dumbass put the gasket on backwards. So I literally had to take the intake back off and swap it around. So with all that being said and done, I am gonna start bolting everything back up, or like plugging in the harness and all that stuff. Um, getting everything pretty much ready. The last thing I need is a mass airflow sensor. I think there's one around here. I don't know. But right now I'm going to just button everything up and look for it. And then we'll go from there. If not, somebody said they'll sell me one, but I have to wait till tomorrow. Which sucks because I was trying to get this car done for Super D so I at least can drive up there. But yeah. I don't know if you guys can see the spider web very well, but uh, he's in for a rude awakening when I get this car running and I start driving it. I ain't going to ruin his home. He made his home there. That was his decision. He's gonna get fucked up soon. Well, goddamn. Even though the car looks really ugly right now, it's ain't a bad view. All right, so motors together. Uh, pretty much all I need now is the Mav. So I have it kind of hooked up. I'll, I'll show you guys real quick. Um, bring the exposure up so you can see and bring some focus. Ah, focus, there we go. So the plug here, um, that's for it. Doesn't plug into this one. I found out this ma uh, mass airflow sensor is for an S13 dual cam. Uh, and then reading some forums, um, people pretty much just said that the only difference between the two dual cams is the S14 has a different harness on the intake, which is the reason why I had to swap it out. And you can't use the maps, uh, obviously. And then here's how you can tell. This is a S13 uh, valve cover gasket. The bolt is right there for it, and then the S14 is actually in the back. Um, luckily, I used this before I knew that because I was I saw that one and I was like, it's all the way in the back here, and I'm like, dude, my firewall's in the way. The hell with that. I'm gonna use this one. But kind of thinking about it now, so I don't think that bolt's actually. Oh, it's bolted in. Weird. That head might also be a S13 dual cam. I don't know. The only difference that it, that it makes is the intake and the ma uh, mass airflow sensor. Those are the two things that will stop it from running in an S14. So if you have an S14 intake and an S14 mass airflow, you're set. At least that's the research I did. So anyways, <clears throat> that's all I'm going to wait for. I'm not going to drag this video out a whole week like the last one you guys just watched. And those of you that did go to Super D, uh, I hope you guys had an awesome time. I, I really I'm really am bummed that I missed I'm missing the event. I'm gonna try if I can get this mass airflow sensor tomorrow morning. Uh, somebody says he has one, but he's out of town right now. But if he can bring it early in the morning, I can throw it in, fire it up, see if she runs, test drive it for a while, and then oh my god, there's a cherry pick right there. And then I'm literally if it's if it's fine and it runs fine, I'm going to, I'm going to the rest of Super D because I really want to go. But the car is important too, and I'm really, really, really excited about this car. Like, those of you that actually know me on a personal level know how much I love S14s. Like, just, yeah. I'm not a big S chassis person. Like, I never, like, I, I think they look cool, but I'm not a diehard fan. But these ones, diehard fan. I will see you guys all in the next video, which hopefully will be this running. Possibly Super D. If not Super D and I don't make it, We'll do a video shoot with this. We'll go clean it up and do a whole big old test drive and see how she runs kind of video. So I'll see you guys all then. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Go check out our website. Uh, pick up a couple t-shirts, a hat. We got phone cases. If you guys want custom phone cases of photos of yourself, message me on Instagram and I can make you one. All I need is uh, a payment and a photo that you want on a phone case. And I will see you guys all later. Bye.